Hey everybody, Wanna Wisdom here, 1032 p.m. It is Thursday, March 12, 2015. I didn't plan to play Minecraft now. I was going to get all caught up on my Skylanders like I've been doing. What we did, uh, episode 36 was special. The walkthrough king came on. He felt for you having to watch me mine cobble all the time. He wanted to make a cobblestone generator. Uh, I decided to let him do that. Just in part, it meant a lot to him. And number two... Uh, it brings up the topic I've been wanting to hit up, but more importantly than that, I got to throw my extra diamond at him, which was extremely important to me. Um, why? Because that's something I can't do on my own, so that was very, very cool. Uh, making that next episode 36, I kind of continued discussing things with everybody. Um, we got eight diamonds, and that is just awesome. So, uh, we also got eight pieces of gold, so we got a nice stack here. Um, what all do we want to unload? I guess some of this cobble can go. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll start hauling it up to the top eventually. Uh, we may have to make another iron pickaxe to finish this. I don't know. That one's unbreaking, but it's about gone. How much iron? We only have seven here. Is there any in the chest? There's not. Well, that's kind of sad. Let's get rid of that gravel, too. I don't need it. So we'll keep one stack of blocks handy. Ah, the redstone can go. Um, <laughs> let's make another set of torches, basically. Actually, let's uh, get this going. They're going to place one. Yeah, one will get... We only have seven, right? Yeah. So we'll have that smelting. We'll get some XP when we ever decide to come back for that. Make a few of these. Get some sticks going. Uh, we'll do the uh, axe first. That's kind of important. So it is... Where did it go? There it is, right in the top corner. Didn't see it. Um, torches now. We're going to need not too many. That should be sufficient. I would imagine. So, what we did last time, this is the type of thing that I've got to do, and I don't know if people want to see it. There's the option of everyone leaving stuff for me to talk about, Skylanders, or uh, life, or music. I don't know what it would be, whatever you want it to be. That's really the only thing that would make this guaranteed something you might want to see, <laughs> you know, type thing. But on the flip side, it's like... I could do this off camera too, and I'm cool with that. It would obviously would make this series shorter, you know, but um, it is all solo survival. It is all vanilla. There's no mods. There's, I don't jump into creative mode when you're gone. If I did, we wouldn't be down here doing this. But what I'm running into is like, I just, I don't know if I want to continue making videos where I'm just mining. Up until the point of we found diamonds, which that alone took five episodes of trying, uh, and all the mining prior generated none. Um, I'm cool with that. But after that point, it's kind of like, you get the feel. You know, you understand there are times you just don't magically say, oh hey, it'd be nice to be enchanted, let me go get some diamonds. And you know, you come back in ten minutes with twelve of them. Uh, it does not work that way. So, this whole area down here, I call it the Hall of Bedrock, and it was basically where I was working on the chest full of cobble. And this one's a little bit bigger. Uh, maybe 10 blocks or so because we hit lava down there but I stopped these torches on this wall on row 3 go count by 5 and at the 30 mark I ran a tunnel all the way down that way and then I turned and I came into the central hallway that we dug out and now this one as you can see 5, 10, 15, 20, 25 and I guess that's 30 so that's kind of messed up, isn't it? <laughs> uh, let me let me count that again just to make sure. All right, so that's number five. It's number ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty. Yeah, that's number thirty. So we can work with that. Let me just uh, pick this up. No, that'll actually, I guess, be smart to have anyway. So. This is our enchanted pick that's unbreaking, but it will break. It's funny how that works, isn't it? Oh, good lord. Yeah, I hate that freaking camera angle button. It's going to be the death of us. Oh, now, that would have been handy when I was making obsidian right there, wouldn't it? <laughs> so, like I said, I knew there was a, obviously lava there, but a ravine over here 
So the 30 slot isn't looking that sweet on this one. Let's, uh, what do we want to do? You gotta watch the edges, too. Uh, why are there no blocks? Then? Let's get the hoe out of there. That's That might be important, wouldn't it? <laughs> okay, a whole stack will come in handy. Alright, so I'm going to throw that down, throw that down. You always got to watch the edges and make sure you don't do something that's going to like make it cascade, you know. Um, let's just, for now, block that off. And this is the type of thing, though, like I was going to say, I never know. If I do something off camera, I could have been right up here. Whoa, oh, that was a late, late goer. I could have been right up here and just burned to death. And then I have to come back in the next episode, and you're like, wait, why is he at level 2? And why doesn't he have all his armor? Or what happened to his epic diamond sword or bow? And then I have to explain it to you, like, well, I was off camera, guys, and something catastrophic happened. And that's what I'm trying to figure out. I'm trying to figure out a nice balance for everybody. And I don't mind at all doing it, you know, like total vanilla here. But at the same time, you know, I understand that might kind of, like, get old for some of you, so... This would be 25 right there, so maybe we could fudge this out and make it the 26 slot. We gotta be on high alert here, <laughs> basically whatever we do. This would be 1, 2, 3, 4, so this would actually be number 5. Let's just take that. Lava is a great light source though. The problem is we'll be hearing that for a while, so there's 1, Two, three, four, five. But I'm, all I'm going to do in this video is just kind of finish out this interconnecting thing. Dad gum every time I do that. <laughs> How did that get there? Okay, let's see if we can get this going better. Uh, dirt is often an indicator of lava when you're this level. <laughs> Ask me how I know. Um... I don't know if that was a skeleton or if it was just the music queuing in, so... Alright. Yeah, obviously you know I'm being careful here, that was two we broke. Okay. There's our level five there. I'm here in lava and it is not from over there. I don't see anything dripping just yet, and it's probably over that way. But, you never know. Let's probably go enchant this stuff before... Okay, so that was one, two, three. And then, that would be four. And you never know when I'm going to wind up in a ravine, either. So, okay. Nothing's dripping down just yet. So, one, two, three, four. Okay, <laughs> let's stick a two or two over there, and it's it's definitely a lava lake somewhere very near here. <laughs> now, the trick is you don't ever want to like let gravel be what gets you down. So there's number five. Well, here's our marker. Dang nation! Every time that happens to me. All right, so let's try this. One, two. Three, four, five. Okay. So nothing crazy. We're doing okay. <laughs> and we're going to mark that. Let me actually count this now. I need to see. We've had a lot of excitement here, so I'm not quite sure where we're at. Alright, so this would be our starting point. That would be 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Alright, so we got that going. Now the fateful turn. Let's see. If there is lava on the left, you know it could be on the right too. So there is one, two, three, four, five. Awesome. This is going smooth. I'll go ahead and throw that. I should probably just put the torches closer to me, shouldn't I? We don't really need coal on our hot bar, do we? Alright. That's gonna make our life significantly easier. 
one, two, three, four, five. But to me, I mean, there's always the excitement because I never know what's going to happen. And that's what I'm afraid of is just simply I won't be recording when something awesome, stupid, hilarious, interesting, you know, whatever it may be. Uh, if I walk into lava, if we walk into a giant, you know, pocket of diamonds, if Hero Brian shows up, whatever it is, uh, it's just one of those deals. I might save that. See if we can ever get an anvil going, you know. So, unenchanted, and you can see the difference. Actually, you can't, because this one's not that great. Unbreaking, that's all we got. Oh, really? Pretty sure I was on the bedrock when we clicked. Now, what we'll be tunneling here, tunneling to here, is just, of course, our central hallway thing. So... Why is that lit up? Are we off a little bit? Oh, apparently we are. So we should have been here, I guess. <laughs> okay. Well, the good news is there's iron down here. And we needed to, uh, you know, hollow all of this out anyway for what I had planned. So, not a bad thing. What I could have sworn it was 30. Let me recount that then, since we're here. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see what happened. Oh, well. Stuff happens. Um, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and take a chance. See if we can't maybe just get this stuff here, because I want an anvil would be one of our next progressive goals, you know. Here in the lava... So, oh, we gotta be really careful of that gravel. Because the gravel could slowly be ushering in our doom. In fact, it looked bright up there. Um, I don't recommend what I'm about to do. Okay, what is going on here? Oh, that's the torch we put. Okay, so everything's cool here. Everything is fine. It's, it's not that big a deal. But... Gotta be on guard here. And if you're go... Uh-oh. Oh, that's the hallway. Okay. I was like, why is that lit up? It's lava by a skeletor. And again, the reason that is off a little bit is just because that's kind of how it had to be. So, let's go ahead. I don't recommend this at all, but... Okay, that is acceptable. That's acceptable. <laughs> um, let me actually... I don't like being in a two-haul. Alright, so... That's okay. The lava is definitely in that vicinity. <laughs> and that's what's kind of scaring me. The good news is I did put the diamonds in the chest. I think you were here for that. I can't remember if we did that. I guess that was last episode. But anyway, let's we don't have to do all that right now. Let's try to let's flirt with the redstone too. Feeling lucky. Now this is interesting. Okay. This is where we could potentially really actually hit it. I don't like those tall voids, the gravel leaves, <laughs> you know. Because lava could come cascading down. Or not. You never know. Let's just go ahead and open this up to that wall since we know it's clear. Okay. Four little shovels about to go. Let me actually check my inventory here. We don't want to... Whoops. Okay, we got a few open slots. So let's mine out the rest of that very carefully. Okay. Now, I'm just going to go ahead and I guess we could eradicate that. We could technically go the 30 from the back side, I guess. But let's leave the lapis until we've kind of like security checked the area around. And there is always the chance we could come across some more diamonds. Okay. I haven't seen lava like seeping through the ceiling here, so that's good. Ideally, we just hit another one of those eight pockets of diamonds, you know. 
I've got a safe distance here. Uh, this is a hallway we can back into. I got blocks on the hot bar. We're playing it smart. We're definitely playing it smart. Smart. This is just like the giving ore right here. This is awesome. I guess I should grab that. I hear the lava again. Um, nice peaceful music coming when a skeleton slay us from behind. Alright. Let's take the lapis first, I guess. Finish it off. We've almost gone the 30 over, you know. <laughs> okay. Uh, and of course the reason we can do that is the lava. So this would be 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. The iron is 30. Stand back. This could get ugly. Alright, so... Uh, I can't complain too much about this. We probably should have enchanted before we got down here, but I don't see lava, but we do hear it. Yay, okay, so we're not dead yet. Uh, this is almost the end of the episode, though. We're doing decent here, but hey, this is, wouldn't it, uh, 26, 27, 28, 29, this right there would be 30, I think. So, I guess we could cobble this out. I'm tempted to go in and see how close we can get to the lava there. Um, it would be smart to put all this stuff away. But, who are we? You know, we're, we live, live wildlife life dangerously. And I did hear lava, it seems like, somewhere in that area, too. Might have been more towards where we found the diamonds, though. Um... You know what? That wasn't what I wanted to do. Uh, let's actually light that up a little bit. And I think, let's see if we can do this. Let's go ahead and uh, set this up. Crafting table. Alright, we'll throw that there. And now we will make ourselves a chest. And we'll, throw, we'll try not to put a lot in this one. Uh, I'll just get like some of the important stuff in there. I'd like to keep the iron on me, but I guess I can wait. So that'll be that for now. And just in case something crazy were to happen, <laughs> we'll kind of shield that a little bit. So let's flirt with disaster, shall we? This is our five out, and we know the lava's over there. The, I'm not liking the gravel being mixed in with this. Is that? That's not looking nice. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna actually make ourselves, I guess, a stone shovel would be sufficient for this. And I'll try to remember to use it and not Mr. Enchanted. So. I don't, this is probably a dumb idea, but hey, you know, only live once. Oh, baby. This, and again, you know, everyone's like, yeah, you want to be at level 10 to find diamonds? I have my best look at level 8. Well, I'm having my best look at bedrock in this version, so that's my story. What's <laughs> up? So, Alright. Gotta be real careful here, because... We don't know what's going on with the lava. So let's go ahead and keep that safe. I want to kind of, I guess, eradicate all of these options for leaks. The reason, that if you ever, like, in creative or if you have fire resistance and you're just, like, really bored or curious... What can happen is, a lot of times, the bottom of a lava crater is, in fact, people always think it's cobble, but a lot of times i found it is actually dirt. So, that's why I'm kind of a little cautious here. Oh, yeah, that's the good stuff. Okay, there's lava. <laughs> that's not what I wanted to see. So, let's leave the ore. 
I'm gonna go ahead and open this up a little. So like I said, my theory is confirmed there. Um, man. Let's see if there's anything under it. I'm hoping, you know, if there's like any lava there, it's gonna just seep out. Now, that dirt should stay in place. This is, this is dangerous what I'm doing. Okay. I don't want to take too many chances here. Alright, so let's call that good. Okay. Now, we're going to come in. We know up above that, it's definitely got lava. What we don't know about is down here. So far, it's looking like we might avoid it at this level. So, let's check this out. We got plenty of room here. We got blocks and water. Okay. All right. So we should be okay to get these, which is great. Okay. Let's uh, go ahead and do that. Ordinarily, I like to check above it completely. So I guess I should... <laughs> Alright. The only thing that could go wrong is if that block there is connected to lava. And it wasn't, so whoopity do. Alright, we're just past 20 minutes there. We've kind of done what I said we were going to do. Um, I'm going to throw that there just to kind of be like, hey, you might pay attention here, buddy. <laughs> but uh, the good news is it looks like we can just chisel this thing out big time. Um, we want to be real leery of that gravel. Because it is about going up where that would be vulnerable. So I think what we need to do, instead of me wasting more tools when we have the enchanting table, I think we need to just basically get me back up there, enchant everything, and uh, see what we kind of get into. So there was that. Um, okay. Oh, that was the enchanted shovel, dang it. Oh, well. It... We can get efficiency one, no problem. Uh, that said, we're doing some decently cool stuff here. And it's like I said, I mean, I just, I never know what we're going to come across. I'd like to get all of this out, if possible, just right below the lava lakes. So all that's safe. That is all dangerous. <laughs> and, uh, let's see... should be able to all go at least to that cobble height right there. So I'll throw that down and we will just clear this out, kind of make it a little bit more spacious if you will. Alright, so eventually, I mean that's kind of the thing, we're gonna like try to hollow out this whole area. It's kind of the ultimate goal, mainly for cobble and uh, obviously diamonds, uh, because they tend to be all over this place. <laughs> you know, which who would have thunk it? But uh, that's again, that's something I kind of see. Not a lot of people talk about it, but I've kind of seen it enough for me to kind of believe it. So um, that said, again, I've left all that there in hopes of not doing something stupid. In fact, I think we probably ought to, you know. Let's actually, um, okay, this should be, okay, <laughs> uh, I'm going to unload these because they're very important to me, and let's just, yeah, that should be okay, uh, this is way too long of a video, I'd kind of like to cobble that out, wow. Uh, I do not recommend doing what I am doing ever under any circumstance, but 
Because just because like these are open, that doesn't always mean that'll happen. Now these were definitely seeping earlier. Okay, let's let's go ahead and Okay. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm trying just really hard not to have the uh um, camera angle change. So we've got the lava there. And let's just I guess fence it off. Okay, it's done expanding. Um, I don't want to use that pickup completely, so this is okay with me because that's going to light things up and it will also tell us where it's at. So I think what I will do is kind of throw that up just to be a little safe. Now, it was over there is the source block. I guess the gravel actually makes a lot of sense to spin there because then it can turn into flint when we remine it. Alright, now as long as you don't change the trajectory of the source, in this case that spout up there, you're gonna be okay. You don't want to use gravel for that, <laughs> but uh, we'll go ahead and let me actually All right, now we're into the true danger zone. And we should have that coned off. There we go. So I'm going to actually leave all this here just in case we continue to do that. Um, let me... Okay, so all the lava's gone. You can see what a great light source it is. I don't know where that torch went. All right, let's get a torch up, speaking of that. <laughs> and... Uh, uh, this will be the last thing we do. This one's probably got lava with it as well. Okay. So that sweet sound there is when you place it quickly. But that's kind of how you can work with the gravel, you know, and kind of make it do what you want. So I'll go ahead. I guess we'll just use this thing up. No point in keeping it. I'll kind of get the light flowing again. Eh, we didn't get flint, but you know, you get the idea you can sometimes. So, seems really dark with the lava gone, so I'm gonna throw that up. And once again, I guess we could break these out. And that's a good stopping point, is it not? <laughs> I'm gonna just basically uh, do weird things with torches to kind of remind me, like, why are those stupid torches there? And it's Hopefully then gonna have lava drop down and I'll be like, that's why those torches are there. So that said, I'm gonna end this here. We've kind of interconnected all this. And this 30 by 30 area is what I'm contemplating whittling out. Ideally I would come in and we would like just eat up all the lava in here too. And then I just have this giant chamber. I don't even know what for, but we would just work with that. So that said we got some more diamonds. I didn't plan at all to play Minecraft tonight. I'm gonna get some of these rendering. I'll uh, work out real quick and uh, I guess they will be added to the list of videos. So as always thanks so much for watching. Off camera I may run up and uh, Take some cobble with me, put it in the chest, hit the hay, and I'll be ready for the next episode on a new session. I don't know for sure what I'll do, but so nothing too crazy. As always, thanks for watching. You can follow me on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, circle me on Google+, whichever you prefer. Once again, uh, thanks for watching. If you like the series, leave a like, leave a comment, tell your friends about it, have them subscribe as well. And I will catch you back here for the next episode of our Minecraft Xbox One Solo Survival Playthrough. Mm -hmm.